Brandon here with Tommy Joe Martins. Spent after two laps short of halfway, you guys spent the night here in downtown Chicago and then it got announced that they will not be resuming this race. What was your overall reaction to that? Uh, I think everybody's got the same reaction to that. What, can you say anything to NASCAR for doing this to you guys? Because I mean, let's be honest, you guys lost money from this because of having an extra flights, extra hotel rooms. You guys lost money. It's just the time, really. Uh, it's frustrating because the decision that was made today was a decision that could have been made yesterday. So that's, it's really even more so than money. It's really about the time. Gotcha. And obviously... What's been going on the past couple of weeks? Uh, I would tell you it was a couple of different things. Uh, the mistakes are the primary cause of all of it. Uh, mistakes last week in qualifying when you got to execute with a car number that's low in points, and then uh, this week just knowing that you had to get in on time. And really that nobody was safe, right? Even the car that's 26 and then points winds up going home. We knew that going into it, and we just didn't execute. Last question for you. Obviously, not the way you wanted to end this, but did you like racing on the streets? Should they come back? Should they go somewhere else? But on a street course, I've, we've heard Denver, uh, the Meadowlands. Um, what are your thoughts on, on street racing for NASCAR? I think this is a cool event. I think the track, uh, from all the driver feedback that we got, was fairly well laid out. I think there's some places there could be some improvements there. I mean, I'm, I'm not holding the ring against NASCAR here. I mean, this is unfortunately just something we're dealing with. It's not good for anybody. It's bad for the event. It's bad for the fans. It's bad for us. Uh, you know, I'm not going to get mad at that. Uh, I expect us to be back here next year, and I expect the event to, to be better. This is Daniel Hemrick, driver number 11, College Rich Chevrolet. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Also, check out one of those two videos beside me. Visit frontstretch.com for more racing content.